Welcome, this is MH Soft. In this video we'd like to show how to take in new elevations with new uh, patients. Here we have our symbol of our application placed on the desktop and with a usually click I can open it. Here a presentation of our company. Just then just share the start button and it comes to this window which is our main menu. So here we have the button for the SL9TR to check in new measurements of new patients or patients we already have taken, let's say last week for example. So then it comes here to this decision because it might be a new patient, a patient we haven't taken in, it's a really new one, or it's about to take in, let's say, the third elevation of a patient we have taken, we have already taken, let's say last day or last week. So then it comes here to this uh, window, it shows us all patients we have already taken to make a choice. Now which one is it? Is it <coughs> person number one or person number two? We want to take in now a new elevation and we can even set a filter here. So, and then I would click here on this line which is marked to take in a new elevation of this person. And then again I can make a choice between the person likes to put in his answers directly at the PC or I have here standard modus which means I am the one, the uh, doctor, the assistant in the hospital and I have 10 or 20 questionnaires I need to take in today and then I would do so with this button. This, uh, this uh, just some infos here we have set here in the demo version is not so important and now we should see this window. So all we have 90 fields here as the questionaries have as well. All fields here are already filled with numbers. It's just to be able to use these drivers quicker, faster, so that I don't have to fill these fields by myself. Here we see some empty fields. It's made with intention to simulate the situation as it is with the questionnaires as well, because it is uh, that um, patients are not always give answers to each question. There might be answers with, where there's no uh, answer and this should be possible to take in as well. So let's uh, save it. Then we get here just uh, information that these fields here are empty. Uh, it's asking us if we still wanted to save it. So we say yes. All entries have been saved and we are back here to our main menu and we could take now a new elevation. Next person or maybe even the next questionnaire from the same person. Let's see how it works if a person likes to put the answers directly at the PC. So it's an again additional measurements. We click we're choosing here our last patient we have cared before and instead of calling standard modus we set a click here on patient puts in his answers directly and then it looks like that it's almost the same window we had before just with uh, two fields here at each question it starts here with the first one it's a blue colored field and go straight to the next one. I put some answers in here. So and now um, as it is with paper questionnaires, the patient likes to correct sometimes an answer. This is also possible here. Let's say this one I like to correct. 
So this one, this number is deleted now, and then here we have the field, the new answer, but it's not possible to change it again. As it is on paper questionnaires, it's, also, it's always just for one time possible to change a field here. So let's go straight over these fields here. And let's also save it. It's the same way as we have seen before. And we are straight back here to our main menu. So this is how it is. This is how pretty easy it is to fill in, to take in the questionnaires of patients in our application. To see how to get out the results, it's another one, it's another video we have placed on our webpage. If you have any further questions, don't hesitate to call us. Thank you.